Good everybody. Um, to start with our belt making, as we all know, belt is a, a straight line looking object. As you can see, this is a straight line looking leather. This is our, our leather. We're going to be using some, some basic tools and some basic material. First, I'll go to the material we're going to be using for this, for this course. Yes, our leather, our synthetic leather to be precise. We will be needing our, our rope, our belt rope. Basically, this is a 1.5 inches of belt. Okay, let's measure and see. This is our 1.5, which one so? This is 1.5 inches belt. We will be needing our belt head. This is our belt head. And we're going to pass on through this, um, this the material is going to be inserted through this belt head. And that's exactly with our material we'll be using. Now, some basic tools that we're going to be using. We're going to be needing a tape room. We're going to be needing our punch. Now, to take note, this punch, as you can see, it comes in different sizes. This is a bigger one. We have a smaller one also. This is a smaller one. But basically, for this course, we're using this size for this course. Okay, now we're going to need our armor. Very important. We're going to need our scissors. This is a punching board. This is a punch. This is a punching board. We punch this on this. So that is that. Our, we will be using, needing this our, our material, our, our engine for the eyelids. This is what they call, this is what they call it. This, this ring, the silver ring looking on this, with the plate behind. So, it's going to be this engine that is going to be using this eyelet, like this. So, one, it's about one when you're about to use that, we introduce that. This is our gun. We've been needing this gun, our gun board. Where is where we're putting our, our, our gun? Basically, that's all we need for this. Okay, now to start with the full practical, we're going to be pouring our, our gun on this place. Now, when you're pouring the gun with that thickness, you pour your gun with your left hand and you hold your gun brush with your right hand. Then we pour. And when you're pouring, you carefully pour little quantity you need at once. Then we use our gun brush to cut through the gun. I see that, then you stop. You cover your gum immediately because it dries off after <clears throat> you are not using it. Then we go to put this one with gum. Now, we are using this gum now. You don't put gum and you are going like this because it's it's smear. There's something called, that is called smear, meaning it it's draws. So you take little you want, up and down, the gum to cut off. Now you go on the material you want to use now. But basically, before, before I go to the material, <clears throat> We'll be cutting the length breadth of our cutting is um two point six. Okay, this um uh, the matter is wider. It's two point. Okay, this is two point seven. As you can see two point seven. So we go for that. We 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 want to apply the gun to the material. We're not going to apply it to the full the full leather. Just half part. Um, side to side like this, like this. You leave the middle blank. So we're going to do that to the full leather. Okay, now after the application of the gun on the head, is leaving the middle blank, leaving the middle blank. Now we're going to fold the edges of this. It's going to be off the outline. It's going to be round like this. Now with the aid of the ruler, place this at the edges or uh, at this middle center view. Of this, place at the middle. Then, when you're doing your folding, you fold this to the edges. Fold this to the edges like this, like that. Carefully, like that. That. After the folding of the, the edges of the leather, using the aid of the word of the ruler, as you can see, we've done end to end of the material. We take off the ruler and we bring the belt. This is the belt. This one is to reinforce the, the leather. We bring the knot. Like this. So we're going to use 
this as a guideline for folding of this other end. As this is like this at the edges, you carefully bring this like this. As you can see, just like that. We make sure this part is straight, like it's end to end of each other. And we carefully fold the other end to it like this. Remember, don't mind the middle of this. Hold like that. As you see, we fold um, the edges of the material together. Here is the back view. Here is the front view that we are working on. So with the aid of this I've said earlier, like folding this on this with the, with the width, we need the width of this belt. So after that we done, we carefully bring the material to the aid of our armor. We armor, we armor the edges. We armor both sides of the belt, as you can see. So after that it is done carefully, then we come to the gummy part. We need to come both of them together. Once we go carefully, then we sew. We sew together. So we want to go for the gummy now. center of the belt. Remember the center of the belt. Just like that. Center. is done we also, we also focus on the center of the material the clothes one of this the application of this the gum on the edges uh, we carefully bring them together at the center view of that okay Carefully bring them together. We try as much as possible. The belt should not separate um, good side to side at the back. You can see this is the back view. This is the front view that we are sewing on. Okay, make sure it's at the center. Gum the belt and the leather material. Gum them together end to end. The next thing we do now is we carefully go to our armor and just hang on it together like that. And use the side also. The next thing we're going to do now is we go to the sewing. Now this part you're going to carefully sew on the edges like this. I've done partially on this. This is what I want at the edges. So now I want to commit to sewing. Now when you are sewing, simple. You just focus the edges of this part at the what at, at the edges of this something like this. And the next thing we need to do for me now is um we want to affix this belt head to it. We want to affix this to it. How does it look like? And after that is done, we are going to put in this at the center loop of the belt. Then we are through the belt. Now let's go. One of these is to this. The first thing we do is with the aid of our pin knife, this is our pin knife, we're gonna separate this, we're gonna separate uh, the the material a little bit, so separate it carefully. Um separate it a little bit, not the whole. We do that to the other hand. We separate also. Okay, and we can easily use this to like take this one off. Okay, like 
turns out. Now what I want to do for me now is I want to fold the edge of this like this. I want to fold the edge like that. I want to fold these two inside like this too. Something like this. This is what we want to achieve. So that our belt will be at the top of the leather and our base will be like this. Are you seeing that? Okay now. Let's leave this one fold like this. Let me take this one to get inside. To make things easier, let's use a measuring guide to know the numbers of inches we are going to be losing inside. Okay, let's make it um, let's make it two and a half. Let's make it two and a half. Sorry, this is a pen I um um a marking pen tries on serials on dark surface. It's a silver writing pen. It's called marking pen. So let's use this the way it is marked. Two and a half. So after this is on the half part of this, like this. Mm -hmm. Like this part now. Is where we're going to punch. This side. We put our punch there. With the aid of our punch. Open up this, separate the rope from the behind, and place this at the center. After that is done, we carefully bring our bed end. Carefully bring it inside, like this, and fold this, like this. Anything that, then just use our hand to go a little bit. Turn it inside out. So after this is done, then for this belt now, we also bring it back like this, and we fold also end to end. This is the back view, and this is how the front will look like. So, to make, to make things easier, we're going to be placing our highlight to measure 45. This is 45. For this 45, we add 1 inch to it.
rid of our plates. Thank you. 